And we're back with number three. Today what we're going to talk about is snacks. Because we're eating three meals a day. And we have to snack twice. The reason we snack isn't just to uh, have something to eat in between meals. There's a reason for it. It keeps your metabolism working. So your metabolism doesn't jump up for breakfast and then dive down and then jump back up for lunch and then dive down, jump back up for dinner. When you have the snacks in between, it keeps it kind of level. So your metabolism's working all day long and it helps you to burn calories a lot more than if it just was on at certain, you know, three times a, a day. So when we're looking for snacks, what we're looking for is something around 150 calories, give or take. So I show you what I what I snack with. An easy one is an apple. Apples are nice medium-sized apple like this, around 100 100 calories. Can be more if you got a big apple. Could be less if you got a small apple. Another good thing is a peach. A yellow peach like this, nice medium sized yellow peach, is about 50 calories. It has less sugar than an apple, so it is a better snack. You could actually have three of these peaches as a snack. You know, but when I have the the peaches, I also have carrots or you know something like that to to help fill in where the peach is only 50 calories. Um, if you just need something sweet, you, you're snacking on, say, Terra chips. Terra chips are delicious. They really are. One ounce is, hang on, it's about this much. And if you look on the back, right there, one ounce is 150 calories. So there's your snack. And if you just need something sweet in between those, Jello Sugar Free is 10 calories for half a cup serving. 10 calories. That's like nothing. So, you know, there, there's multiple flavors of Jello available. And if you're on a budget, there are generics. So, there's a lot of options out there for snacks. Um, let's see. This is what 180 calories of cashews looks like. These things, I don't know what they are. Snap peas. Okay, baked snap peas. <laughs> this is one serving, it's 130 calories. So you could have these and uh, some carrots. You know, a, a full carrot is, I think, 25 calories. So, you know, that's not bad. Have one of those bags and a, and a carrot. And, you know, when, when we're eating our meals, so you don't get bored with them, you know, spice them up. I tend to put uh, garlic or onion powder or pepper or some of my favorite, hot sauce. <laughs> Every type of hot sauce you could imagine I've got. And, of course, my favorite is this one. It's Melinda's Ghost Pepper. Whew. It only takes a little bit. This one bottle lasts a long time. But you throw a little bit of that in with anything that's got beef in it, and it really brings out the beef flavor. But you only use a little. Don't, don't overdo it. Don't think you got to put half the bottle in. You won't be able to eat it. I like spicy stuff. 
you know whereas most people would use black pepper i usually use the ground red pepper it's a little spicier but uh this week i'm staying on schedule pretty good but i did cheat yeah i was bad boy we had some uh some uh pig skins chicharrones i don't know whatever they're called and they were just sitting there so yes i'd every so often reach in grab a couple it's like you know an ounce of it is 80 calories. So I'm thinking, ah, I'm just eating a couple little pieces. No big deal. Well, I kind of slowed down my weight loss. I did still lose weight. I did lose four pounds this week. I am now down to 273 pounds. My goal for one month would be to get down to 270. So that means over the next five days, I have to lose three more pounds. Very possible. It's not out of the realm, so I consider myself still on track. So I'm crossing my fingers, you know, trying not to do that snacking thing again. Because hey, I could have been ahead of schedule and actually been down to the target weight for the month right now, and that would have put me ahead, which would have made me really smile. But for now, that's fine. I'm close enough. I cheated, though. Ooh. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a new toy. It, it, stupid little sound machine just to really irritate people. But that's okay. So, if you're sticking with me, comment down below. Let me know where you're coming along. Are you trying the, the diet that I'm doing? Are you trying another diet? Where are you at on your journey to become a sexy beast? Am I there yet? What do you think? Huh? Am I getting there? I, think, I don't know. I don't see it. Somebody over here in the peanut gallery says she sees it. I don't see it. That's okay. That's right. Eventually, I will see it. Eventually, you'll see it. So stick with me and remember episode 4 which is coming up maybe it'll come up in a few days maybe it'll be next week we'll see episode 4 is the uh, the recipe and I'm going to show you how I cooked that breakfast with the sautéed mushrooms and eggs delicious man that was a good omelette and it was under 200 calories. It's great. You could still have your coffee. Uh, I would highly suggest instead of using milk or cream that you use the artificial, whatever, you know, the, the non-dairy creamer like this. Because if you notice on the back, it's only 10 calories for a teaspoon. One teaspoon is equivalent to using a tablespoon of creamer. So... By using that, we save on calories. Because Kramer is, I think it's 40 calories for a tablespoon. So, everywhere we can save a little bit helps us out. So, if you like coffee, you like cream with your coffee. If you like, let's see. If you need your coffee sweet, that's what I use. It's like Splenda. It's just the generic version of it that you find at Kroger or Fry's. It's their brand. And it, it, it works. It makes it so I'm not using sugar. So all these little things, stuff like that, will add up. And so far, let's see, what have I lost? 20... I think it's 27 pounds. No, not 27 pounds. What am I? 23 pounds. I can't count. I think I need to go back to school. <laughs> I love that little noise toy. It's probably going to get annoying to you, though, so I'll probably not. I'll probably have to quit using it. But all right. 
come back for uh, episode four. If you have any questions, ask them down below. And I'll see you in the skinny zone. <laughs>